Hello everyone. Welcome to Tech World with MJ. This is Muradi. Today I will explain something a very common issue related to Sonar Cube called a report exporting. Okay. So in case of free version of Sonar Cube, if you will go and generate the report, so the report generation after the report generation, it is required to share that particular report with your team members, with your client. So in the free version of Sonar Cube, you will not be able to do the same issue I also faced in my case. That's why I have searched uh, some other plugins that can help us to generate, uh, generate uh, I mean, export the report and share with someone else with our team and uh, the client as well. Okay. So uh, if you will search uh, related to the that plugins, so most of the plugins is already available on the market, but uh, the most of the plugins is based on the license. I mean, you need to pay something for that particular license. Okay. But uh, today I will explain uh, the plugins that is totally free and I will add that links from where you can download that plugins and you can use uh, with your Sonar Cube to generate report completely free. Okay. So now come on the prerequisites. So obviously, uh, if you are using the Sonar Cube, you must have the Java version, updated Java version. You must have the Sonar Cube windy. In, in my case, I'm using window so i'm using the binary uh in in your case you can use uh, the exe file to installation and all as well once uh, this prerequisite will be there then you will go to check the further steps okay so here the next step is uh next step is download the cnes reporting library so i will add this uh, link in my description so you can download from there and uh, once you will download this library then you will copy from the download file and you will add uh, under the binary that you have used for the sonar cube running okay so here under the binary you have a folder called extension under that you have a folder called plugins and under that you will uh, add this uh, library okay and uh, so after the library adding, library adding, you must have to stop your uh, running R cube and you, you must have to start restart your system because sometime because of restart, uh, that sonar cube is not going to be started. That's why you need to restart your system. Then after the restart, you just need to go and run the sonar cube that it's and I will show you where that uh, output will output will be there so here i have highlighted the section called more okay this section will not be there in the general case i mean if you will not add any plugins then this more section will not be there uh, you can experience in, in your case so once you will add that particular uh, library then this more section will be here and uh, how you can generate how you can export the report i will show further okay that's it so let's come on my system I will show you everything step by step. Okay. So here I have, I already have the June, uh, Java version, latest Java version installed and also have the Sonar Cube binary in my window system. Okay. So this is already available in my Sonar Cube uh, C drive. Under the Sonar Cube, you will go inside the extension, inside the plugins. Here I already have added the sonar dash cnes dash report dash port dot one. This is the latest version right now of the cnes report library. So I have used. So this is the place where you will uh, add that downloaded library in your under the sonar cube binary. Okay. So that is from here. So once you will added this extension under the plugin file, you will close the everything and you will restart your system. Once you will restart, then again, you will go and go under the bin file and you will start your Shonar cube. So here I will click on that bat file. So it will take five to 10 seconds to up our Shonar cube. Then I will show you how that uh, the extra feature after that uh, plugins uh, will look like and how you can utilize it. So it will take some time. Okay, looks my system is slow. 
okay looks already it is running okay that's why it is taking time so we'll try to go on sonar cube panel okay here i will search localhost 900 okay so this is already up and running okay so once you will add that particular library so as i already told you this more section will be here on your sonar cube panel before that you will experience this more section will not be there but after after adding this will be there okay so now click on this more section here you can see the cnes report once you will click on that cnes report here you can you will have the option to select i mean the project so i have currently the three project i can select any of one so for example if i will select this uh, one of my project and uh, what branch we have so currently we have the master branch which is integrated with uh, uh, sonar cube and the language according to your uh, requirement so currently we have two languages english and french so i will select the language english and here we have different things like uh, either we can generate or export this report in docx file or uh, xls or csv so i will not require this right now i will just need to export this in the docx i mean doc file so when i will click on generate button okay so i already have clicked it will take five seconds to generate the report so the process is going on probably my system is slow otherwise it will generate yes so here you can see there i have a, a generated report so i will go in my uh, download file here you can just extract this file because this will provide you in a zip format so here you will extract this and now this is the docs file that you have generated okay so when you will click on this so you will have the all reporting related to that okay so that it's related to the utilization of that plugins with our sonar cube so if you feel this video looks helpful then please subscribe our channel and hit the like button and please share with your dev community that can help uh, someone else as well okay thanks thank thank you for watching